Uh, so here with Joe, here's Nate, here's Dante, and obviously Jackson. Um, and uh, about two, two years ago, two and a half. Two years ago. Yeah, uh, the young people hooked up with Yale or with, um, with Team Impact, which is a program that tries to match up and pair kids with a with a college athletic team. Um, we were so fortunate to grab Dante, and uh, he's now a full-grown member of our team. Um, and it's been a wonderful two years. Hey, what's up, hey, guys? Hey, hey, you learn something new every day. Tyler, I didn't tell you that's Kyle. Hi, Lauren. Good to see you. How's it going? Good to see you. Megan? Oh, yeah, I'm on the phone with Megan. Tyler definitely has a very handsome Some big D's accomplishments. Over the past two years, he's uh, been featured in Sports Illustrated, front cover of the Yale Daily News, New Haven Register. He's won a Walter Camp Award for You Can't Inspire. Got to uh, go to the brunch and uh, meet the Rome Bettis, didn't you? you? Got to meet the bus and the other Hall of Famers that weekend and the Heisman Trophy winner of the year, Marcus Mariota. So he's actually probably been one of the more successful members of Yale football in <laughs> football history. So we're, uh, we're really blessed to have him. And, Put everything in perspective in life, so. Definitely the most popular. Yeah. Two years ago, we began this relationship with uh, with the Yale program, and um, I think we were a little nervous at first for Dante because it was hard for him to come out of his shell, especially oh, especially around such a large group of, uh, of folks. And uh, I would say probably within a matter of the first couple of meetings, he opened right up to these guys. He, uh, we would go home, and on the way home, he would talk about the entire experience on the ride home. Uh, his two brothers, Nate and Landon, who's not here, uh, they all had a blast as well. And then, you know, having the experience that these guys have, getting into the Yale Bowl and, and going out there and walking around on the grass and him seeing the entire stadium has just been a, a fantastic experience for him. I think, you know, you guys could probably agree that he's really come out of his shell since the first met him. Well, he's gotten a lot stronger. Yeah. So, a lot stronger. He's talking right now, but uh, you know, I mean, what has he done? He sung the national anthem. Sung the uh, national North anthem. North Haven. Yeah. He's, He's uh, lit the Christmas tree this past year at yeah. North Haven. We uh, we went to his school on this past Monday, and he was talking to his uh, classmates about friendship, and uh, we got to talk about that. So he's been behind the mic a lot since then. <laughs> oh yeah, he's definitely uh, definitely coming into his own. Dante, what's your favorite part about going to the football games? Um, hockey. No. You like hockey. coming? Do you I like that's the right answer. To, yeah, hockey. that's not the right answer. Do you like going into the, do you like going into the tunnel in the Yale Bowl and coming out with the Bulldogs? Yeah. That, that, do you like uh, the cheerleaders? Yeah. Eli, man. Hey, Eli, yeah. Bulldogs. Hey, yeah. <laughs> Bulldogs. 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 Good job, though. Good job. And he gives everybody, he gives all the players high fives coming out of halftime, right? Yeah, one of my favorite parts about coming out from halftime is actually Dante always stands right outside the tunnel, um, and we all kind of, we all give him high five and come by. Um, I always go give him a nice big hug, and it's a really good way to kind of get a good vibe for the second half. Nate, what's been, what's been like for you? Yeah. What's your favorite part about uh, going to the games? Um, a lot of people Yeah, that's good. Good answer. Good answer. Have you guys gone on any road trips? Yeah, we. Uh, the first year uh, we went on almost all the trips. Uh, mm -hmm. Went to Brown. Where else did we go? We went to Harvard. No, we didn't go to Penn. But uh, I think yeah, Yale, uh, Harvard, up in uh, Cambridge. And uh, this year we'll be at a few more of the home uh, away games. It'll be nice. Yeah, how we react to that? Be Harvard. <laughs> be Harvard, right? Be Harvard. Harvard Stinks, what, right? what are we going to do? Be Harvard, but... <laughs> That's what I was looking for. That's exactly what I was looking for. That's right. <laughs> Do 
the experience, the experience has been for me, and I think Jackson can echo this, I'll let him say where after this, but um, we've just been so blessed and so fortunate that we've had this inspiration and this kind of spark in our lives that just has kind of come and take us, I think, all by, by surprise. Um, like you, you think that this experience is going to be, you know, you have football partners with? No, it's it's about the individuals and about the relationships that form, and about this kind of unbreakable bond between teammates. Um, and like we're so blessed to have this, like these people here as my family. Um, and, and Dante is a huge part of that. He's on our roster. He obviously is the most prolific and dynamic speaker on the team as well. Um, he gets in front of the camera all the time. It just he's uh, he's been an inspiration to to me personally. And I think to every guy on this team for what perseverance and what hard work and a positive attitude can do. Because no matter what, this kid's smiling. 